Alrighty, Monster Jam fans, welcome out here to Reno, Nevada, for the second stop out here on Arena Championship Series West. But before we can begin this evening's Monster Jam action, we would love to thank all those who have served our country. Monster Jam was built right here in the USA, and we are super grateful and thankful to live in the greatest nation on Earth, and to have the blessed opportunity to do all these shows for all of you fans in attendance. If you serve the United States military, or have the Army, Navy, Marines, Air Force, or Coast Guard, or if you're a frontline worker, please rise and thank you for your service. God bless the United States of America. Alrighty, and our national anthem this evening is going to be presented by Avengers Racing and the Steel Titan Sports League. Everybody, please be sure to go check out these sounds. They are really cool. Now, everybody, please rise and move your caps for the singing of our national anthem by Avengers Racing. Coming out to the track first, your current Arena Championship Series West points leader, this is Dalton Widener in Jurassic Attack. Mm
Reno Nevada, get loud and stand with me because this is Monster Jam. Mm -hmm, mm Tony Oaks 
in Thunder Warrest to get the win. Alright, looks like we got a cat on the track hungry. out here. He may be a bit hungry when it is now time to kick off the semifinals out here with Dalton Widener in Jurassic Attack versus Ashley Sanford in Megalodon. And up everybody, ladies and gentlemen, before we start the race, we're currently feeding Kitty Winnie right now. And he's currently getting fed. Um, trying to get the food opened right now for him, trying to pour out the food onto the ground right here, right outside the Reno Live Sparks event center. And we're ready to go. Here we go. Who's going to the final round? Let's find out. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And your winner is going to be Dalton Widener in Jurassic Attack. Next up, who will go to the final round? We've got Tony Oaks in Thunder Wars versus Brandon Vincent in Gravedigger. Who's going to the finals? Let's find out. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tony Oaks is a little roll over save right there. It will cost him the win, giving the win to Brandon Vincent in Gravedigger as he's going to advance on to the finals. Continue on to expand his points lead. Alright, Monster Jam fans, it is now time for our second competition here of the evening. The Great Flip Skills Challenge. Each driver will get two opportunities to perform their best moves on two wheels. Some of these two moves you may see these drivers do are stockies, moonwalks, slap wheelies, poppers, bicycles, or maybe even a combination of these moves. So, Reno, Nevada, get loud and be ready for the Great Lift Skills Challenge. Coming out first, representing for Team Throttle Monster, this is Devin Winfield in Velociraptor. Nice or slap wheelie for Devin Winfield and Velociraptor. One more attempt left to go. Next to the little stopping, that's going to be down the run for Devin Winfield and Velociraptor. The score for Devin Winfield and Velociraptor is going to be a 6.101. That is going to be your leader to kick things off out in the Great Flip Skills Challenge. Coming out next, coming straight out of Dog Pound, this is Bird Go to Reno and Monster Mott Rottweiler. Mm, 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 mm. 
Nice there for a little slot really right there. One more attempt left to go. I have Roberto Trevino. Mm, 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 mm
Nice, there's gonna combo it into a wheelie. Back down into a stoppy. Wow. One impressive first attempt out here from Tony Oaks. One more attempt left to go. Nice here, popper off the car. And he's gonna set it down, and that's gonna begin the run for Tony Oaks in Thunder Roar. Tony Oaks in Thunder Roar is gonna be at 9.280. And that's going to be good enough for the lead. Your brand new leader is going to be Tony Oaks in Thunder Wars. Coming out next, representing the black and, black and red wrecking machine out of Kill Devil Hills, North Carolina. This is Brandon Vincent in Grave Digger. Mm -hmm. A nice tombstone moonwalker off the eight pack. Gonna set it down, one more attempt left to go. <laughs> Nicer popper off the car. <laughs> Nicer's gonna kick it up here into a wheelie. Nice combo. Mm. 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 And he's gonna set it down, and that's gonna be the end of the run out here for Brandon Vincent in Grave Digger. Or for Brandon Vincent in Grave Digger is gonna be a 9.1. One, nine, oh, good enough for second place. Young leader is still going to remain Tony Oaks in Thunder Wars. Coming out last, this is Dalton Widener in Jurassic Attack. <laughs> Man, Dalton had a nice little stop you right there going for him, but he just sets it down early. And one more attempt left to go. Nice bicycle across the arena. And that is gonna be the end of the run here for Dalton Widener and Jurassic Attack. Your score for Dalton Widener and Jurassic Attack is gonna be an eight point one. Zero five, good enough for third place, which means your Great Clip Skills Challenge winner is going to be none other than Tony Oaks in Thunder Wars. Congratulations out here to Tony Oaks for winning the Great Clip Skills Challenge out here. You definitely did need this win here to try to catch up in the points out here and continue to climb his way towards the top. Tony Oaks had two great hit. Two great hits. A stop you right here off the burn. Walking it up, cobbling it into a wheelie off the, the pod. Walking it out, cobbling it into another stop you and walking it out right here to the end. And then 
over here. There you know, then he came over here and did a nice popper off this car right here. And he did a nice popper and he just had an amazing two hits here from his run. Just great job out of here for Tony Oaks as he's gonna pick up the next eight points here. Here towards this evening's overall event championship. Everybody right now it is halftime. Stretch, go get food, go get water, and come back soon in half an hour for when we for that's when we'll return with our monster jam action for the second half of this evening's competition with the BKT Tires Freestyle Competition and the Monster Jam Donut Competition. You don't want to miss. Monster Jam fans, we're now back from halftime, and it is now time to begin the Monster Jam Donut Competition. Each driver is going to get one attempt to do their best donut. Some of the stuff the judges are looking for when judging these donuts are speed, the amount of rotations, and how long they can donut for. So, Reno, Nevada, get loud if you're ready for the Monster Jam Donut Competition. Coming out first, this is Devin Winfield in Velociraptor. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nice donut right there, that's going to begin the run out for Devin Winfield in Velociraptor. For Devin Winfield in Velociraptor is going to be an 8.610. That's going to be good enough for the lead to kick things off out here in the Monster Jam Donut Competition. Coming out first, coming straight out of the dog pound representing for Team Throttle Monster. This is Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler. Mmm, mmm, he's just gonna jump it up in the air and just crash it. And that's gonna begin the run out here for Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler. For, for Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler, it's gonna be an 8.875. That is going to be good enough. For the lead, your brand new leader is going to be Berto Trevino and Monster Mug Rottweiler. Coming out next, representing the Crazy Bull, this is Manuel Solorio and El Toro Loco. Mmm, 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 mmm. that smoke out of the nostrils out here. Mmm, 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 Manuel Solario and El Toro Loco is going to be an 8.444. That is going to be enough for third place. Your leader is still going to remain Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler. Coming up next, representing all the hardworking men and women, this is James Calhoun and our Shaker. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nice little donut. He's going to save it and. And that's going to be the end of the run for James Calhoun and Earthshaker. James Calhoun and Earthshaker is going to be an 8.795. Good enough for second place. Your leader is going to remain Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler. Coming out next, this is Ashley Sanford in Megalodon. Mm, 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 Nice there, Tony hitting it across the arena and hitting the burn. And now he's the end of the world. After Sanford and Megalodon, it's going to be 8.654. Not enough for the lead. Your leader is still going to remain Berto Trevino and Monster Muck Rottweiler. Coming out next, representing for Team Throttle Monster, this is Dalton Widener and Jurassic Attack. Mmm, 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 mmm. And he's just gonna donate into the ground. That's gonna be the end of the run out for Dalton Widener and Jurassic Attack. Four, four. Dalton Widener and Jurassic Attack to be an 8.428. Nine up for the lead. Your leader is gonna remain Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler. Coming out next, representing the black and red wrecking machine out of Kill Devil Hills, North Carolina. This is Brandon Vincent in Grave Digger. Mmm, 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 Nice solid donut right there for Brandon Vincent in Grave Digger. Score for Brandon Vincent in Grave Digger is going to be an 8.873. Good enough for second place. Your leader is still going to remain Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rockwiler. Coming out last, representing the Apex Predator, this is Tony Oaks in Thunder Warren. Mmm, 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 mmm,
Your score for Tony Oaks and Thunder Roris is going to be an 8.850. Only good enough for third place, which means your donut competition winner is going to be Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler. Berto had a quite an interesting donuts out here. He probably flew in mid-air and then just crashed. I guess the fans really loved that, and so and that is why he got the win. Congratulations down here for Berto. This is also his first ever career win out here in Monster Jam. So great job out here for Berto Trevino and Monster Mo Rottweiler for this win. And he's going to pick up the next eight points towards tonight's overall event championship. All right, Monster Jam fans, it is now time for our final competition here of the night. The BKZ Tires Freestyle Competition. Each driver is going to get two minutes to tear up the track to do their biggest and best moves. Some of the stuff you may see these drivers do on this track are big air, crazy saves, technical maneuvers, donuts, a backflip, or maybe even in something wild, crazy, and new before. We've never something wild, and crazy, and new. We've never even seen before. Stuff the judges are looking for in judging these freestyle runs are creativity, momentum, breathtaking saves, huge vertical air, wild factors, the use of all obstacles, and the completion of the time. So, Reno, Nevada, get loud for me one last time. If you're ready for the BKT Tires Freestyle Competition. Coming out first, representing all the hard-working men and women, this is James Calhoun in Earthshaker. <laughs> nice laugh when they kick off this two-minute run. <laughs> Monster. This is Berto Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler. <laughs> we got the truck fixed back up after a wicked crash and donuts, and they've now got the truck ready to go for freestyle. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Mm-hmm. 
Sanford and Megalodon. Your score for Ashley Sanford and Megalodon is going to be a 7.999, good enough for third place. Your leader is going to remain Berto Trevino and Monster Mug Rockweiler. Coming out next, representing the Crazy Bull, this is Manuel Solorio and El Toro Loco. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, 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 Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm.
Seconds are left. The aim pack is all messed up, but yet he's gonna line up for it. Mm. And he's going to nail it. Trying to like, jump him right there. Tony is just going to end it right there on his lid, and that's going to be another round for Tony Oaks and Thunder Tony Oaks and Thunder Wars is going to be an 8.7, 3, 4. And that is going to be good enough for the lead. Your brand new leader is going to be Tony Oaks and Thunder Wars. Tony out next, representing for Team Throttle Monster. This is Devin Winfield in Velociraptor. Mm, 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 mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now 
Now Brandon's having some issues with the rear steering in the back. See if he gets these tires. It looks like he's just gonna burn it down anyway. Freestyle win is going to be good enough to see if we can get Brandon Vincent the overall event championship. Once again, congratulations to Brandon Vincent and Gravedigger on the BKC Cyrus Freestyle win. All right, everybody, your overall event championship winner has been decided. After getting a total of seven points in the JCB Racing Competition, seven points in the Great Clip Skills Challenge, seven points in Donuts, and eight points in the BKC Cyrus Freestyle Competition, for a total of 29 points, your overall event championship winner is going to be none other than... Going to be none other than Brandon Vincent in Grave Digger. Congratulations to Brandon Vincent for picking up this overall win. And this is exactly what Brandon needed here on his season. This is definitely going to help him out continue to grow in the points to get to where he needs to be at the top spot. So this great job out here for Brandon Vincent in Grave Digger. Just what a great job. He really did a great job here in this show. He was really consistent, finished in the top two, and around every single competition. He was very consistent tonight, and consistency is key. And just congratulations to Brandon Vincent and Gravedigger. Let's see where this will land him in the season points, as that, will, as that is what we're going to look up. And the next, um, next up, as well as where the next stop on this tour is, as well as the, um, the, as well as the, um, event results from tonight. Alrighty, everybody, now we'll wrap up tonight's event here in Reno, Nevada. Let's go ahead and take a look here at the results from tonight's event. Here are the results out here for the JCB Racing Competition and the overall event championship points. And here are the results for the Great Clip Skills Challenge, Monster Jam Donuts, and the BKT Tires Freestyle Competition. Here's the season standing results out here as some big news. Brandon Vincent and Gravedigger will launch to the top spot with 71 points. And then in second place is Tony Oaks and Thunder Roars with 69 points. Third place is Dalton Widener and Jurassic Attack with 65. 
Fourth place is Berto Trevino and Monster Mo. Rottweiler with 53. Fifth place is Devin Winfield and Velociraptor with 52. Sixth place is Ashley Sanford and Megalodon with 50. Um, seventh place is Manuel Solario and El Toro Loco with 47. And in last place is James Calhoun and Earthshaker with only 27 points. Now the top is really close out here between the top three. I mean, it is like, and only six points separates the top three, and only two separate the top two. This is a really interesting battle out here. And my congratulations for Brandon Vincent for jumping up to first after his really great event. Um, Tony Oaks jumps up to second. Also, he had a great event. Dalton Widener slips down to third. Berto Trevino with a good event will hop to third. Devin Winfield will fall from second to fifth. Ashley Sanford will fall to sixth place. Hopefully she can catch up. And then Manuel and James are the struggling at the bottom of the points. This tour's next stop will be next Friday, January 26th in Sacramento, California. As we'll be doing a Monster Dirt Arena event out there for Sacramento. So that is going to be awesome as that will be the first Monster Dirt Arena show for this tour, tour which will be interesting after the past three, the first three shows of the tour have either been still Titans or Pool Table. It'll be really interesting to see how these drivers will do on the Monster Dirt Arena for some shows here in Sacramento coming up next Friday. So everybody, be sure to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell so you guys can be notified for when the next stop on this tour takes place in Sacramento, California. Alrighty, good night everybody. Have a God bless night and we'll see you all soon for some more Monster Jam action. Peace out everyone.